hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel or welcome if this is your first time tuning in my name is yola chimde and in today's video i'll be sharing with you all how i incorporate these two powerful ingredients into my hair butter to make them more healthy and beneficial to my hair, to my scalp and also to my hair strands okay so the first ingredients i just sh showed you guys are rosemary leaves and you all know the benefits of rosemary you can do your own research to know more about rosemary okay and the next ingredient that i'll be using for this hair growth butter are fennel seeds fennel seeds are very very um beneficial to the hair they have lots of nutrients lots of vitamins and um, compounds that will benefit your scalp and also your hair strands so guys this is what fennel seeds looks like they somehow look like rosemary leaves but they are more shorter and um, has a, a little um, weight to it so i am scooping two tablespoons of the rosemary leaves And also I'll be using three tablespoons of the fennel seeds I added two tablespoons here but I later went ahead to add one more tablespoon of the fennel seeds so now I've combined the two ingredients together and now this is our career butter we'll be using shea butter as our career butter shea butter is one hair butter that i will never stop using on my natural hair because it helps to keep my hair moisturized for a long period of time it softens my hair strands and make them more elastic i don't know if you all have noticed that but shea butter is really really the best when it comes to retaining moisture and keeping your hair soft and manageable all right so i'll be using um a good amount of shea butter just the quantity i know that will be enough for me if you want to make more of this use more ingredients but if you want to make a smaller quantity you you know the amount that will be okay for you okay so i've combined the three ingredients together and um, i'll be using the double boiling method to infuse the nutrients into the shea butter okay double boiling method helps you to retain a lot of nutrients because if you if you like um, cook it directly on the heat the the vitamins are going to die quickly because you know that vitamins do not survive in intense heat okay so now the shea butter is gradually melting as the water is boiling underneath as you can see Right now the shea butter has melted very very well but I'll still leave it on the fire for some minutes. I'm going to be leaving this for 10 to 15 minutes okay. You don't need to leave it for so long. So now the shea butter is ready and I will take it out of the fire. This is what the mixture looks like. And I'm going to be straining it so that I will separate the ingredients from the hair butter, alright? And if you leave this for so long, the shea butter is going to solidify and it will be very hard for you to strain it or separate them. So now I'll be using this little mesh to, se to separate the ingredients from the shea butter. And you can see that the oil or the butter has changed color that is to show you that it has infused properly so this is what our melted shea butter looks like i'll go ahead and quickly transfer it into the um, container that i'll be storing it you have to do this immediately because if you leave it for a long period of time the shea butter is going to solidify and it will be hard for you to like transfer it into the container that you want to store it in 
so right now this is what our hair growth butter looks like it's still in the liquid form which makes it an oil but don't worry it is going to solidify the next day so i just left it outside because outside is really really cold at night so i left it outside at night for it to like solidify and i will show you all what it looks like the next morning so guys this is the next morning and as you can see the shea butter the hair growth butter has solidified um but they are not too thick at this point but with time they are going to get very very thick if you don't want your hair butter to be very very thick please go ahead and go ahead and add an oil okay so guys this is what my hair growth butter looks like so i'll go ahead and wipe it a little bit so that the um, ingredients are going to make together are going to mix together because at the time that it was resting um, some of the particles settled at the bottom of the butter so I'm wiping it to mix everything together and to also make the shea butter easy to you know apply so this is the consistency after stirring it I will also go ahead and show you all how I apply this on my hair strands okay so guys as I do that let me share with you all the benefits of using rosemary and fennel seeds on your scalp okay um, rosemary leaves contain antioxidants it contains anti-inflammatory properties and also it contains antimicrobial properties so with this whole benefits it is going to give you a healthy scalp it is going to help treat um, scalp infection it is going to help combat dandruff if you're having um, itchy scalp or redness it is going to help suit your scalp all right so that is the benefit of rosemary rosemary also help to prevent premature graying okay it also stimulates the hair follicles it also bring about um, proper blood circulation to the scalp which improves healthy hair growth so these are now the benefits of phenyl or scion seeds okay scion seeds are known to prevent hair loss it has essential nutrients and compounds that promote hair health it strengthens your hair follicles and also gives you a healthy and thick looking strands Thank you so much guys for watching to the end of this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and click on that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell and also give me a like, okay? Bye!